In this brief session, I will demonstrate how to insert a screenshot and how to use a screenshot feature in PowerPoint 2016. So there are times where you're designing and working on a project and such, and you want to add part of your screen, whether it's directions or something, to a slide into your presentation. So what you can do is you can go here under the Insert tab, and there is this option for Insert Screenshot. It basically adds a snapshot of a window that is open on your desktop or your document and it becomes a picture basically entering it in your uh, computer. In this case what we do is you can click on add screenshot and then you want to choose the option for screen clipping. So you can either take a snapshot of the, one of the applications that you have opened or you can uh, do a screen clipping and you click on it and now it's giving us a chance to select something from this screen. So if I want to have a screen clipping of how to insert an image or a screenshot on PowerPoint, I could simply select this. I'm clipping part of the screen here. And now notice it inserted it automatically here. But you can customize this. Notice you have the design ideas. You can utilize design ideas here and, and tweak this accordingly by selecting one of those designs. And additionally, you can use the formatting tools to make this a little fancier. So notice if I use one of those styles here for formatting this snapshot that I captured, I could use the tools above here. So let's suppose I want this one with a shadow border around it. And the other thing that I'll suggest that you utilize is if you go here under insert and then click on uh, shapes, so you go under insert and then uh, let's say I want a rectangle here. Okay. And then I want to change the shape here and then under the shape fill, I want to change that so that there is no filling to it. And then for the border or the outline for it, I can choose so it will be red so that the audience would uh, kind of see what I was working on. The other thing that you could do here is that under the outline, you could change the weight to make that heavier and such. So now I can copy that same object that I copied created earlier and I'll paste it somewhere else here and let's say that I want to demonstrate to the audience that this is the option that they should click on. Now each one of those you can also animate them if you needed to. So if you were to go under animations and then say okay I want to add animation I want that to appear and then I want this other animation item here as well I want that so that it actually flies in. So I'm under the animation tab, fly in. And now when I go to present this, it will show up. This is the captured image that I picked earlier. Now if I click, it highlights this section here. And then if I click again, it will choose a screenshot. That's how the screenshot option works in PowerPoint 2016.